Well, you know it's bad when even the snow plows are getting stuck. The drift's too deep for one of the little recreation path plows in Silverthorne today. That's where our man in the mountains, Matt Renew, is showing us the mess from this busy holiday weekend. This is a long weekend with a lot of people heading into the mountains at a time when we are seeing a lot of snow and a lot of traffic problems. It's great news for the ski resorts. They've been asking for this and they got it now. A lot of the ski areas around Summit County saying they've gotten more than a foot of snow in the past two days and close or more than two feet of snow in the past week. But driving around hasn't been easy. We've seen a lot of I-70 closures today between Copper Mountain and Vail. Highway 40 near Berthet Pass had an avalanche today with some cars stuck in that. Luckily, no injuries, but it closed the road most of the day. In fact, watch out for a lot of safety closures in the next couple of days for avalanche mitigation work to deal with all of the snow and more importantly, all the wind loading from these high winds. CDOT will be busy with avalanche mitigation after this big winter storm. And this storm's not over yet, right as people are leaving on Martin Luther King Jr. holiday tomorrow morning. Another foot is forecasted for some parts of the high country and that won't make getting out of the mountains any easier than has already been trying to get out of the mountains tonight on Sunday. We'll have to see was this storm still not finished in the high country. Reporting from Summit County, I'm Matt Renew, 9 News.